come back and from the time it took me to go downstairs fold the laundry and come back up i have reflected on my actions <laughs> i know sometimes in video games whether it's fighting games whether it's my <laughs> first person shooters sometimes i talk a little bit of shit especially when i'm winning right when i'm quiet you know not quiet when i'm losing i don't like to say mean things right? i don't like to blame my team i don't like to get angry at my enemies but when I'm winning, I can get a little wacky. I can get a little goofy. You know, some would say I could get a little bit brain dead or terminally, term, terminally online. I would just like to call it being a little goober, but hey, teach their own. Everybody's uh, vernacular is a little different, right? But I've reflected. I would like to point out it's all in good fun. I'm just playing. Uh, in case that wasn't objectively clear <laughs> from the shit that I said, I have no ill will towards anybody I play with or against, except the four players that fucking surrendered when we were winning and it was close on arena that one night. Those people hope their families have good lives. I hope they live the best lives possible. And then one day it all comes falling down. The kids leave them, their spouses leave them, they lose their job, no, I don't want their livelihood taken away, I still want them to be able to eat, like I don't want them to go off the deep end. Hold on, let me refresh this. Oh, one day they boot up their computer, and everything's been uninstalled. A command prompt boots up for a second and then closes when they boot their computer, and they have to delete everything and reinstall it, and it takes them like six to, six to seven hours on their day off. That's what I hope happens. There we go. I can get behind that. Man, I love me some Smite, baby. 